Hello, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Action Nerve, and welcome back to the Gothic Castle tutorial. This is part nine. We better finish this damn thing by now. <laughs> I don't want to hit the double digits. Apparently, views go down when you hit the double digits for some reason. Everyone's like, no, no, ten is too much. Nine is fine. Ten, I'm just not gonna watch it at all. It sucks. Anyway, uh, last episode we finished this stuff. I believe. I think it was last episode. Yeah, and, and did things. Uh, there were some comments. Uh, people were confused. Uh, for the, the stairwell stuff. Oh god, whoa, hello. Uh, on this orange side specifically, because this is one we, we did in the tutorial. Uh, they didn't know, you know, this stairwell. Uh, I didn't include it because I was being lazy, but it, it's fine. It doesn't uh, interfere with anything. If we go around here, the stairwell is back here. Somewhere. Did I put it on this side? I don't think I put it on this side. Where's the stairwell? I'll show you guys. Let me go over here. Where is it at? Here it is, right here. It uh, it just goes on the back side. Of, it, it's kind of in between these two pieces, so it's perfectly fine. Uh, you don't hit anything. Uh, but today we're going to work on the the upstairs part, the upper upper parts of the castle. But first things first, what you want to do is come over here and uh, turn these damn fires off because uh, they spread bad it's not good <laughs> fire no good turn these off uh, I think we're gonna be working on the red side today we're gonna do a tutorial for that one uh, it's the same thing on the inside uh, as I said before in a bunch of the other uh, earlier videos uh, this be kinda like a let's build sort of stuff not really I have a design for the upstairs and the orange side see you can see it through the windows uh, and it's pretty cool I think it works well probably gonna be working on that and doing that uh, and if we need to we'll try and figure some stuff out but let's go take a look at it oh by the way this um, yeah I don't know why but for some reason in whatever part we did the gate and the walls uh, these these uh, crenellations are kinda small <laughs> they, don't, they don't look too good so to fix that just add in some stone brick blocks on top of where the smooth stone slabs were put some upside down stairs in between them then put your slabs on the blocks and then you can take out these lower upside down stairs because it looks weird and just put in some uh, chiseled there we go chiseled chiseled blocks and it works okay uh, close your eyes real quick because we're going to uh, our mouse is gonna stop working um, there we go fixed it uh, we're going to go through here. So you can't see. You can't see. Don't look. Don't look. It's a surprise. Let's go around here. Ah, uh, where am I at? Um, back around. Um, is this a good one? No. What? What? Wait a sec. Oh, here it is. Okay. Now you can look. All right. All right. So, let's take a tour, shall we? Let's actually go downstairs. Let's start start at the bottom bottom. All right, so from the stairwells, this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna come up the stairs to the second floor. This little room, uh, this doors go out to the uh, balcony round area. I don't know what you'd call that. Anyway, come back inside here and some weird horrible design for the walls. Uh, up the stairs into this room. This is where the big windows are. Cool things. This goes in here. I put carpet in. I put white carpet just because I don't know. Don't have any designs for it. I really the only thing I kind of did in here was just made rooms, <laughs> like just filled in the walls, um, put carpet down for the floor, and kind of made do with what I what I had. Not really had any specific design in mind. But anyway, let's go up here. This leads out to this stuff that we were just doing. I replaced the black wool with glass. You can keep black wool if you'd like. I think glass looks pretty cool though. Little window. Um, back here is the doorway to the stairs right here. This comes up. There's some storage on either side. And then the stairs up here lead up to the to the upper upper parts of the castle. The upper 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 squared. Over here leads off, off into this room which uh, which is underneath the pathway where the towers are at. This actually goes down to here, so it's kind of pointless 
but uh, whatever. The other side is the exact same because it's uh, right. It's not really the exact same. Uh, what are you doing? Because it's just mirrored, mirrored. Come back down here. On this side is the same stuff. I just didn't put the carpet in, so you can see what we have here. We have our uh, our wool for the first floor. I put the reason I put carpet in mainly was because of this. <laughs> you can see the wool, so you gotta put something there to cover it up. This goes down into this room, of course, just to mirror side. I I, did, I stopped right here because we're gonna work on the red side today, so I didn't want to continue it off. I wanted to have like a fresh side to to start off with, even though this is kind of here, but kind of distracting. Uh, we'll go upstairs real quick. This leads up into this room. That's uh, right above the gate area. And it leads up again into here. We can put some torches up. There we go. This leads up into here. This is the... Oh, hello, ladder. Ah, stop it. Stop. Here. It leads up over here to the balconies on the big tower. And if you go up the ladder, through here, whoop, this leads right up to the top. Ta-da! And that's it. Woo! All right. Well, give me one sec. I'm going to make sure I... Oh, wait. This back here. This leads off into here. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> kind of a tiny little hallway, but uh, it's, what I, it's what I could do. Couldn't do anything else. Anyway, give me one sec, and I'm going to um, get everything ready for the red side. Where is that red side? Red side... Right here. Okay, so we're going to be using the... Um, that design mainly and um, and yeah hopefully it'll go well so uh, actually you know before I just you know pause and <laughs> go fix things or make sure I uh, remember how to do it we're gonna start off really um, by filling in a lot of the space in between the walls with uh, with stone or a non flammable material because you have the fires on the other side it burned of the wood I was around. I don't know why it's not burning those. Oh god. Um, I'm not sure. Underneath the glass though, put down quartz or white wool or stone or whatever you want to use. Uh, so it looks fine. Anyway, let's do this. Just fill in all of this area. All at the same level. So we have a flooring to uh, to use, I guess, it's a good word. It doesn't really matter. Um, back here, I mean, we're going to, uh, to cover a lot of this stuff up, but you can just fill it all in anyway, because I mean, you're not going to see it, so whatever. <laughs> Unless you're doing this in survival, you're just crazy. So we'll do this all the way around, and uh, just pretty much I mean you know you can just pretty much connect all of the floors like this except for right around here where this door is at we're gonna stop right here on this little block this wall and just fill this in because I don't quite remember how we're gonna do that so we'll just stop right there and the other side is right here and we'll just connect it up and leave this big hole right there fill all this stuff in down once again, leave this area open. I'm sure we're going to take some of the stone off, but uh, we'll just have it for now. Alright, so you guys get the idea. Fill this in. Once again, leave this side open because this is where our door is at. So we'll just go on top of the stone bricks. Okay, and I didn't do this side at all. Great. Fantastic. <laughs> Put the quartz right here, and we'll continue this down, just like that, and of course fill all this in, down there and all this stuff. Anyway, um, so after you do that, you're going to come over here and build some archways for our windows, and repeat the same pattern that we have on the outside. So right there, it's flat, and we're going to add another layer on top of that. right here right there and then put on our upside down stairs there we go just like so do the same thing for these of course put the quartz underneath them but uh, 
pretty much the same thing. This and that. Put our upside down stairs. Okay, you can stop it right here. We're gonna put um, some spruce wood uh, as the flooring for this floor and the ceiling for this one. You know, killing two birds with one stone. For the tower, um, we'll get to that when we do this uh, higher floor. Or no, we here anyway. What, I don't know what I'm talking about. Um, let's come back over here. Do the same thing for these windows. Of course, put the quartz in the bottom. Build our archways. There we go. Knock that out. We don't need you. Boom. Nope. Boom. There we go. Okay. I think that's it. Of course, those as well. But that should be it for uh, for those windows. Yeah. All right. Well, I am going to um, finish up the floor right here and then review the uh, design so I can get it fresh in my mind and uh, then we can move on. So I'll be right back. All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. Here we are, got the floor in. Um, stuff, things, <laughs> hopefully this will go smoothly. I don't think it'll go smooth at all. Uh, I went ahead and just kind of put a floor in here on the green side, kind of matched the uh, stuff on the, uh, the other side of the red to kind of hopefully make it easier to see what we're doing. We're gonna start over here on the second floor double door thing. We're gonna start off by uh, putting in a floor and just take our spruce wood and just kind of build it out all along here. I think that's what four rows from the wall it should be fine for now. All right, so after we do that, we're going to fill in these holes right there. I'm going to add in some stone. There we go. Some stone bricks. That's the word stone bricks to that wall to fill in that space. And we're going to take off that stone block and replace it with stone bricks. So now we have a wall right here that is one, two, three, four, five blocks long. The other side, we're going to do the same thing. Uh, I'm going to add it on to... Where do we want to put this? We can put it right here if we want. That should do fine, I think. Nah, you know, we'll stick we'll stick to what we did on the other side. We're just gonna put four right here until it gets up to the stone right there. Probably about four blocks high, should be good. Right here we can replace this stone, add in some stone bricks. The reason we're keeping this right here is because it's right where that uh, stair is on the floor beneath us. We have to have that right there. So it kind of differs from that side, but uh, there's nothing we can really do about that. Now we're going to take off those two stone blocks and add in stone bricks. Just like so. About the same height should be fine. Then we're going to extend our floor right along here. By the way, this side does not have the stairway on on the wall. The orange side does. So what you do for the orange side is just, since you already have the stairway right there, just keep it there on the wall and just add on your other, uh, their other block like that. Should be fine. Come back around. Can we get out of here? I guess we can. Nope. That goes somewhere. Where am I? I'm gonna go out here. Back around. Work. All right. So now we have that done, we're going to extend our pathway all the way down till it meets up with the um, stone blocks right here. Okay, and that's going to lead our pathway to go up to this floor. So to do that, we're going to add in a column right here and right there. A couple blocks high should be fine. We're going to take off stone. No, we want to keep the stone. We're going to put in stairs right here, stairs right there, and then add in the columns to the side. There we go. Boom, boom, and we're up here. Cool. Okay. So far, so good. We're going to take off those stone blocks on both sides to replace them. 
so it blends in better. We can actually bring these up a bit. And there we go, we have our, our room done. Let's add in our ceiling real quick. Just right above the windows. Bring it all the way down. Okay. And right here, down. All right. All right, we can take that off. Should be good. We can take off these three spruce wood blocks and replace them with stairs. And there we go. Voila, let's put in some torches to light up our place. Here we go. Quickly, before I forget, we're gonna take some bookshelves just to add in some decoration while we're here. Take off these six blocks and put in bookshelves. Because they can fit and why not? <laughs> you can add designs to these walls if you like, like I did on the orange side. Although the orange side looks hideous, it uh, at least it's kind of a design. It just, it's the same design as we had on the first floor, like right here. It looks horrible. <laughs> but you can do something like that if you want. But uh, anyway, let's go back. Right here. Alright, so that is our first room done. We're going to come up the stairs and boom, here we are. Alright, next thing we're going to do is do the same thing on the other side. <laughs> so let's add in our floor for this side real quick. Since we already know what we're going to do. Just extend this down. And just bring it all the way down. Fill this all in. The spruce wood. Don't worry about that space. That's supposed to be uh, another layer of stone bricks. I'm just super lazy. I didn't put it in. Okay, and that should be it. One, two, three, four. Right there. Right next to the window. Replace pretty much all of these with stone bricks. It gets to the same height. There we go. Oh, fill those in. Hi, bat. Are you gonna die for me? Hmm? There we go. Good job. Fill this space. Oh, wait, no, this space is our bookshelves. One, two, three, four, five, six. And we can put in that. Take these off. Okay, and then we want to add in those. Then one, two, three, four, five, six. Add in our other columns to the side of the stairs. And we're done. Put on our roof or our ceiling. All the way down. Okay, well, this was uh I think I think those rooms were the most difficult to do maybe I don't know I think it's it's a uh, it's probably on the same level as um, this junk's gonna go right here <laughs> oh whoa whoa added way too many right here whoops got carried away all right throw in our torches real quick just blah, 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 anywhere all right so back up here let's take off these we didn't need these my bad okay now we're gonna take our spruce wood once again and we're going to connect up this side to that side just continue the uh, spruce wood down until it hits something there you go just fill in the whole space and then down cover that up Okay, we got that. Cool. I'm gonna add another layer on right here. I do believe. Hopefully, I'm doing it right. I'm probably gonna do. I'm probably gonna mess something up. Probably a lot of things. Okay, so after we do that, right next to these stairs that come up, we're gonna add in two right there. So it's right stairs, and then boom, stairs right there. We're gonna put in a column of stone bricks right there. Skip a few blocks, come over to this side, and put two right there. Hopefully that makes sense. Yeah. Because these are going to be right next to that wall. These are going to be right next to this wall. I think that is correct. Let me double check. 
No, that is not correct. <laughs> See? Look at that. Get it out of our system first. Get it out of the way. All the mistakes. They go right there. Oh, right there. There we go. And then boom, boom. Okay, do the same thing on the other side. So boom, boom. Add in stone bricks in between them. And right there. Cool. Okay, so we're going to save this for later and break stuff. No, nope, that goes there. That stays. That's good. Okay, over here. We're going to uh, take some spruce wood planks. And we're going to build our ceiling on this side so we can have something to work with. We're just going to start off at this top layer of stone bricks. Let's bring it down. There we go. All the way down. It's a tedious process. And we're going to stop right for this room right there. Because it's one level lower. So, it'll look weird if you have spruce wood going like right there. That, that's, that's not cool. Okay, we'll stop right there. That's good. Alright, cool. Bring this down until it meets up with this stuff. That should be good. Bring it down. Put some more around here. Same level as that. It's cool. <laughs> okay, so we made a big square. Fill it in with some spruce wood. This is going to be our flooring and our ceiling for two floors. There we go. Okay. Now we can take these stone bricks, bring them up there, and then these. Just like that. We're going to take some stone brick stairs. I'm going to put two upside down stairs right here and right there. Okay. Then we can bring this up and that up. I'm not sure what we're doing right here. Oh, we're putting stairs right there. Yeah, fill in that space. There we go. Cool. Looking good. Looking good. All right. So, oh, let's do the same thing on the other side. My bad. So we have our ceiling right here. I'm just going to make like an outline, sort of. I think, yeah, that's about right. Bring it down. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Okay. It should be fine for now. Bring up our stone bricks here. There. Those. Add the upside down stairs. Both those spots. And then these. And right there. Okay, cool. Well. I'm going to pause for a sec and fill in this ceiling and, uh, and check some other stuff so we don't have to pause and think about things so much. So I'll be right back and uh, yeah. Alright guys, um, we already screwed up something. <laughs> Not terribly bad, but it's, it's kind of big. Um, this stairway right here that goes up, we need to move it back. That's going to go right here there there it should be 10 blocks from the stair right here to the wall right there one two three four five six seven eight nine ten cool all right my bad and we can take these off and that these are gonna go right there back our column then our other two stairs and our column all right so not too bad, but my bad. <laughs> Take those off. Those. Fill in this. Alright, and then we can add in our stairs again. Right there. There. And then right here, right? Yeah. Right there. We just fill that in. Okay, if you want can keep it like that or knock off these um, can we do that I think it should be fine <laughs> I say that it's probably not put that there then that there 
Okay, that's cool. Cool, this is fine. <laughs> Great. All right, and the same thing on the other side. I'll just do that later. All right, let me fix this. Put those back in. And actually, we'll just cont we'll just put stone bricks right there. Him and him, we'll add in our upside down stairs later. Uh, cause they're not actually gonna go right there. They're gonna go like right here. But uh, anyway, over here, we're going to um, add a little archway kind of thing around our door here, there. Okay, we can take off the black wool unless you want to keep it there. It's up to you. I'm gonna add in glass. Two, three. One, two, three. And then repeat the pattern. So we have that. Uh, those. Those. And that's it, right? Yeah, cool. And add in more <laughs> stuff on the side. There we go. Alright, so for the door right here, I'm going to knock these off because they look a little weird those. We're going to put in upside down stair, upside down stair, then uh, block upside down stair. There we go. And then we'll put on our door like right I don't know, there. That'll work. Kind of in the middle. Okay, so that's it for that. Let's come back down here. We're going to come over here and put a wall should be four blocks from the window. One, two, three, four. Just like that. All the way up. Okay. And then one block right here. So on the floor you're going to have wool, quartz, wool, and stone. Okay. Just like that. And this will um, fix whatever our roof's going to, or ceiling's going to be down here. So I'm going to put these, you know, we're going to put them right there. Need them across. Place those. And we'll put in upside down spruce stairs, just like that. And we're gonna take a slab and cover up the quartz. Okay, just like that. All right. Now over here in this corner, we're gonna take some bookshelves. Bookshelves. There we go. Thank you. We're going to put six right there. Then we're going to put a column of stone bricks. And then six more right here. Just like that. Hopefully it looks good. I think that's... Oh, why don't you move these back, actually? That looks better. Push back. There we go. And then just uh, continue your ceiling down. Actually, you can add in... Some more books to that. Should be fine. Hopefully. <laughs> he says after, you know, screwed up something big just now. That's cool. Alright, we'll continue on the... This is the, uh, the floor above. Continue this uh, stone brick upwards. Like that. Alright, let's go back down. <laughs> Little detour. Okay. Down here. For uh, For this room. Right up here, we're gonna do some crazy stuff. We're gonna add on two stone brick columns to the side of our stairs right here. So we have sort of this massive two by two column looking thing. Okay, so we have two facing this direction and we just broke one, two facing this direction. Okay, we're gonna add in three right here. Okay, just like that and then two right here facing that way and we'll add in our spruce wood stairs two like so and then one right next to it All right and that leaves a little space of one uh, to go around the corner I think that works good yeah should be fine okay because that leaves a little pathway to kind of maneuver around I think that's fine. I don't know. Maybe we can squish this smaller. I don't think there's anything here I'm going to worry about. Is there? No. Why didn't I do that? That sounds better. 
What was the aim? What was the point of not doing that? Hmm? Hmm? Axio nerve? Why didn't why didn't you do that? It's Oh. It's a little weird, yeah. Hmm. No what well, we could I think that's fine. A little weird though. Dang it, freaking lag. Well, we'll do that anyway. That's better for um, stuff. Oh, God, speed. Okay, so we're coming back over here. We're just going to move these stairs over by one block so that we have uh, a bigger opening to get into this corner and to the other side. That makes a lot more sense than just having only one space. All right, so let's come back over here, and we're going to put down these, and then another set of stairs, and make a pathway just all the way down. Okay, and we're going to be in this room. I'm going to take some stone bricks, I'm going to put some down. Uh, what are you doing there, dude? Why are you there? Right here, I believe. I think. Oh, wait, no, 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 no. Right here. There we go. That was right in the middle of the pathway. That wouldn't have been good. We'll leave a space of two and add another column. Like that. And then just connect those up. Should be good. We can actually take those down and put uh, spruce wood and then build a wall. Right there. Or, or, or bookshelf <laughs> bookshelves for life man bookshelves for life all right uh this space is supposed to be filled up i don't know why it's not <laughs> it's not good up here we're gonna have problems i don't know if i went over this but um there's little holes appear in the ceiling just put down stone bricks is fine i mean it's you're not gonna see it on the outside it's it's a tiny hole so Anyway, okay, for the ceiling for this, because everything kind of revolves around the ceiling, we're going to put, um, take off these stone bricks right there, put an upside down stair underneath the chiseled stone brick, and we're just going to curve it around like so, and just go down a couple blocks. Actually, we'll just go down a few, like one block from the end, it's fine. Okay, and then, um, kind of continue that down. Yeah, the sides. That's cool. I think I did this a different way on the orange side. I believe I, I connected them up like that. Yeah. There we go. Yeah, yeah, like that. Do that. <laughs> that just means the uh, put some stairs along these stone bricks on that wall. That's it. I think. Cool. What are we doing here? What? Oh. <gasps> yes! What are you doing? Hello. I'm gonna put that right there. Actually, keep that stone brick right there. I'm gonna add our other stairs in. Then we can actually curve it around here. Oh my god. Take that off. Curve it around like that. And then put that back. That looks cool. That's neat. <laughs> All right. Well, this this is right here. This is gonna bother us. We don't want that. That looks weird. Uh, so to fix that, add in a plank. Cool. Then we can bring that down. Ta-da! And then put a column up. That yeah, it's covering up something. Column right here. And actually, we can just fill this whole thing in. Or, or, fill it in with bookshelves. That looks better. Everyone likes reading, so we'll keep that. Okay, continue uh, this column up. I think. What? No, we can, we can take that off. We'll put it right there. 
and then that right there. Cool, and we can take all those off, put those in, and put that there. And put that there. <laughs> We're screwing something up, I know. I know we are. I really screw something up. Is that supposed to not be there? I bet. Something, something weird. Okay. Come back to our little stairway pathway thingy. Let's make a wall. Right here. And right there. Right there. There we go. And then put in some planks. All the way down. Cool. It's a kind of a, a tight fit. Is there a way that we can not do that? I think there is. Wait, what is that? Oh, no, that's the bottom of the tower. We gotta have that there. We can put in you can put in slabs. I think that looks better. This is less of a tight fit. And you get two and a half shelves of books instead of just two. So you get half books. Alright, <laughs> so, uh, oh, we gotta fill in that space right there. Actually, just fill that in a bit. Alright, well, I'm gonna stop right here for a break and make sure I'm on the right track and I'm not screwing something up, uh, and then I'll be right back with you guys.